our wish is to make this Society 5.0 as a concept. Still, it's at the beginning, kind of a baby uh, from this fifth scientific basic plan. But the, uh, I can describe this concept, quasi-concept, as a transition from technology center into human center. So human is at the center. And also, uh, we will be taking full advantage of advancements in science, technology, and innovation, including AI. We will discuss about that. But identifying key value as a society to be shared by everybody. Uh, we may say sustainability. Everybody agree? Uh, of course, openness, because you are not closed society. You have to exchange with others in the way that we are advancing with together. And also inclusiveness. I think three concepts, three value are central for Society 5.0. And also saying it's not only uh, scientists of it to advance science, engineer to advance technology, entrepreneur to advance innovation, but you and me and everybody should be on board. It's kind of new approach for that. And for that, uh, we have to combine top-down direction by the government and action from the ground. And we should provide some space for dialogue. That, that's the approach we are proposing. And the, thankfully, um, we had a good echo from business people. Uh, in Japan, we have what we call Keidanden, association of big companies. And uh, uh, responding to our vision, uh, in internally, they have created a new team within Keidanden, working about Society 5.0, and they have published a report. What could be our action? So it's coming uh, on the reality, and then we, we are expecting that within five years, we may say it's a concept and launched by Japan, but probably shared by others.